Second to last week of the regular season for high school football. It has flown by for us. Some of our teams still trying to find out a way to win out for higher seeding when it comes to the playoffs. Alyssa. Yeah, you can't talk about tonight without reversing the clock a little bit. Last season, we saw Midland Valley cap off a performance that ended North Augusta's 24-game win streak against the Mustangs. Now North Augusta is back in prime positioning to take the region. Midland Valley was still able to scrap together some wins despite a slow start. Joe Doring is at North Augusta. The Jackets want to protect their house, Joe. Yeah, Alyssa, this has been a pretty one-sided rivalry throughout recent history. If you take out last year, every time these two teams have played, dating all the way back to 1998, it's been North Augusta taking home the W. Now, here's what the game looked like last year. There wasn't a lot of defense being played whatsoever until the very end of the game when Midland Valley blocked North Augusta's game-winning field goal attempt to win it 49-48. to The Yellow Jackets currently sit at 7-1, and and they don't even need to win tonight to clinch the region. That goal is going to come next week against Gray Collegiate, but this one tonight feels personal for Coach Richard Bush's team. Now, every week's big, you know, especially this game with Midland Valley. They have a tremendous team and a tremendous program, and uh, they've had a good season. And our guys here at North Augusta, they know they know what's at stake. They know what we're playing. You know, we're playing for a lot of pride. We're playing for, um, you know, to be in a good situation going forward this year. So they're looking forward to this week. They're not looking ahead. They know, they know what's at stake tonight. Now, North Augusta's defense has been only giving up at least, or sorry, on average, 15 points a game throughout the entire season. Midland Valley's offense, though, is finding their groove. They put up at least 35 points in each of their last four games. It's going to be interesting to see if we get a chaotic, dramatic shootout just like we did last season. We're going to have more information on your game of the week right here on News 12 at 6 o'clock, Alyssa. Yeah, Midland Valley had one of the closer games against Gray Collegiate this season so far, so good deal there. Tonight, a little ways away, Saluda and Batesburg-Leesville going at it for a region crown. They're both tied in 2A and undefeated, so a heated matchup there, too.